What's up, you guys? WWE fan 0599 here again. I'm here to review Despicable Me 2. And uh, Despicable Me 2 is way better than Despicable Me. A lot of sequels that. A lot of sequels in 2013 that were better than their originals. So, Despicable Me 2 stars Steve Carell, Chris, Kristen Wiig, uh, Miranda Cosgrove, and Russell Brand. And this movie. So, we see in the beginning beginning that Groog is being nice to his kids and um being a good father. So then um so we see this girl that um is like, we need you for something and Groog is all like, wait what? And then when he gets shocked by the late by the lipstick laser and then the minions are trying to come after him, trying to save him. And then we learn that he's gonna be a part of an anti villain agency. And, by the way, Kristen Wiig's character is so over-the-top in this movie. Like, she's, like, enthusiastic. Like, like, oh, yeah, great, yeah, 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 woo! You know, like that. She's, it's, it's funny, you know? And plus the minions in this movie. The minions had me, like, laughing so much. Like, um, the minions were the best part of this movie, in my opinion. You know, I really love the minions, like, they were really, really, really funny in this movie. And we also, by the way, we see one of the coolest animated villains of all time, Al Macho. Yes, Al Macho, I think it was. And, man, is he, fun is he funny and awesome. I mean, in this intro, we see him, like, pouring the, ve the snake venom in his drink. He's like, go, go, and then, and then... Like he puts the snake snake on the money. He's like, "Yeah, what up? I just came. I just came here," and just just breaks through the wall like nothing. And you know, I like the I liked him as the villain in this movie. He was really cool. And we also um, let's see. By the way, the girls were good in the movie as well. You know, um, so yeah, um. So we end up we end up seeing that Groog, um, gets you know gets married to the girl. You know Groog has his happy ending and everything. And also we see during the end credits that um that they're teasing the Minions movie that's gonna be coming out in 2015, I believe. And you know I'm excited for that since I really like the Minions in this movie. I'm excited for the Minions movie. And, uh, so, yeah. So, yeah, this movie was really, really good. Really, really funny. Um, did I enjoy it more than Monsters University or Frozen? Uh, I don't know. I I would put this over Frozen, but I don't know about Monsters University. I really enjoyed Monsters University. But still, this movie is a good time. So, you know, if you have kids, you know, and they really want to see it, go ahead, watch it. It's a good time with the family, really is, and, um, sorry, I thought, thought yeah, I thought I was going to burp, but, um, yeah, just, just, it, it's a good time, you know, buy it on Blu-ray, buy it on a DVD, rent it, you know, whatever you do, um, but, you know, I'm going to give this movie an A+, plus. yep, yep, giving this movie an A+, plus. I think it deserves it, really, it does really much deserve an A+. Plus. This movie really does, so... I thought everybody did great as their characters. You know, Steve Carell did great as Groog. Um, so, yeah, that is my review of Despicable Me 2. Leave in the comments section below what did you think of Despicable Me 2. Did you like it better than the first Despicable Me? Um, so let me know. And I am WWE Fan 0599 and we will see you all later. Peace.